36 new this morning, a local company is using a unique technology, cleaning some of the public spaces we touch the most. The nanoseptic surfaces use light to create a self-cleaning reaction that creators say is stronger than bleach. This is really fascinating. 10 News reporter Aaron Brookshire spoke with the company about how this technology can be used. So Aaron, what'd you find out? Well, there are a ton of uses for it. And while some of the most popular uses for the nanoseptic technology are for door handles or other public surfaces like check-in or help desks, creators are working to get the technology into even more spaces. A recent study of germs in airplanes and airports surprised many travelers, finding that the dirtiest touch point wasn't in the bathroom, but it was actually the check-in kiosk, which had 10 times as many contaminants as a toilet seat. That's when nanoseptic creators began developing a clear self-cleaning adhesive film that could be applied to everything from those airport kiosk check-in centers to checkout screens at restaurants and even iPads in hospitals. And now the technology is about to expand even further with a new product created to help keep our cell phones clean. We're putting our cell phones in some really bad places, resting them on some dirty places that we don't even know are dirty. So those self-defense dots that you just stick on the back of a phone or cell phone case or iPad or whatever are some of the things that we have in the works. He says we can expect to see the cell phone protectors for sale on Amazon within the next month at a price point of less than $20. Other new products include TV channel guide covers for hotels, tissue box protectors, and nanoseptic grocery cart handles and seats for kids. So it's a company based out of Bedford County with this new technology that's really gaining attention worldwide, Jessica and Patrick. Pretty cool. Yes, it is. Now, Aaron, is this technology going to replace cleaning altogether? So they're saying not to replace cleaning, still wash your hands, clean as you normally would, but this is really a boost to the cleaning you're already doing. So it's a secondary cleaning method and it's helping to get those, um, to get things clean on a very, very small level. So it's helping to take cleaning one step further at this point. I was hoping I'd get rid of the Clorox wipes for good. Now. Not yet. <laughs> <laughs> Aaron Brookshire, thank you so much.